Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing my stamping for the Stamping Saturday collab. And the theme this week is birds. So on my nails to start, I have two coats of Oont, which is a peel off base coat. Then I have one coat bases loaded lacquer, low and away foundational base color. Uh, now the color polish that I have on my nails is three coats, bases loaded lacquer, rain delay. Those very pretty shifty uh, blue to purple polish. And I think there's even like a little bit of green in there. I think it's mostly blue to purple. Um, and then the white is two coats, China glaze, white on white. And then over that, a top coat of Salon Perfect Plumping Gel Effect Top Coat. So I decided that I'm going to do um, a peacock for my bird. So I have this peacock plate. Um, SPB19, um, no clue what that stands for. I mean, I've had this plate for quite a while. So this is the back. Pretty sure I probably got it off of AliExpress years ago. But this is the plate I'm gonna use. And I'm gonna be stamping in straight up black. And hit the bottle. Peacock Shimmer, and um, I'm going to be doing some advanced stamping, and so for the beak, I'm going to use Maniology Arabica, Arabica, I'm probably saying that wrong, because I googled it, and it says peacocks have brown beaks, so I'm going with it. All right, so let's get you zoomed in here. So, do the head first in black. Let's see how much is gonna fit on my nail. Oh, this is my old one. Oh, probably gonna have to grab a new one. Well, let's try it and see. Yeah, look, I missed the back of his head. Other than that, though, it came out. So, clean that off. Let's try it again. Let's see. Normally I don't cover the full image, but since uh, since this polish is old, there we go. Don't want these little flowers. So let's take those off. Okay, so 
let's go ahead and color this in because I'm going to need this to dry. Uh, let me get a paper towel so you can see. Going right here. So, I need a nail brush. Let's do this one. Mm, nah, that one's kind of frayed. This one? I don't think that's going to work in the beak. I need a littler one. That should work. This one is one of my many allergy brushes. All right. So, what color am I gonna start with? Let's do his beak first with this color. A little bit down on my mat. Need the very tip of his beak. There we go. You know, I think I want to grab a green to do his eye. I'm doing that beautiful blue peacock shimmer for the rest of him. I don't know if this is going to work, but we're going to try it. So this is lily pad. Let me grab a different brush. I'm gonna grab this one now to do the body. This one, oh, I don't have any name or anything on it, so don't know where I got this one. But now I'm going to take the Hit the Bottle Peacock Shimmer. And that's what I'm going to use for the body. Okay.
I find it easier if I do the outline first. I go outside the line. I did a little bit. Hopefully it won't show though. Missing some up by his neck. Uh -huh. I'm going to have to go over all of it again, I think. All right, so let's see. I'll do a little bit more. Okay, I'm gonna put that to the side and let that dry. I'm pretty sure I'm going to put this one on my ring finger because of the way he's facing. So, now for his feathers, first I'm going to stamp in black. Okay. 
Now, I'm going to go over that with this peacock. Because I didn't think it was going to show if I stamped it in just peacock. Was I even on camera for that first one? If I wasn't, I apologize. All right, so here we go with that peacock color. See how light it comes out? Uh, we're gonna step over. hope you can see that over the black. I mean, I can see it. I'm hoping it's coming across on camera. Okay. Move this to the side. And make sure this is dry enough. It is. All right. So now I'm going to grab my Mini Allergy Sticky Base Coat. And then once this gets tacky, and give it about 30 seconds. Once it gets tacky, I will um, adhere the peacock's body. Hopefully it's not too wet. So I want this to be kind of centered. I'm going to clean up and then I will be back. All right, I am back. I've cleaned up and I have top coated with my Mini Allergy Smudge Free Top Coat. And once that dries, then I'll top it with my Salon Perfect Plumping Gel Effect Top Coat. So, what do you think? I think it's kind of cute. It's not 100% what I had envisioned, but I think it works. What do you think? You could tell that's a peacock, right? Anyway, um, as per usual, I will have everyone else's um, links to their videos in the description bar below 
and uh, at the end of this video I'll have my swatch photos and then everyone else's swatch photo and please go check out the others videos give them a like and I believe that's everything oh maniology code I do have a maniology discount code LJ nails 10 so if you use my code, I'd really appreciate it. You'll save 10% and I will earn a small commission and which I'll be used to buy more mini allergy products. That way I can share them with you. And I believe that's everything. All right, I wanna thank y'all so much for um, watching me and I will see you all next time. Bye.